great story. Now we're going to welcome in our next guest to the Blue Couches. You saw him a couple of minutes ago there. Scott Mitchell of the Erie Zoo is joining us now to talk about what's going on at the Erie Zoo uh, this summer season and what's coming up this weekend. Is it is it your most popular day? It, uh, the most popular single day. You yeah, yeah, we're talking yeah. about equipment day that's happening Saturday. But let's just backtrack a little bit. Talk about uh, what's new at the Erie Zoo this year. A lot going on. Was it, was it Simon and Garfunkel that said it's all happening at the zoo? I think. Possibly, I yeah. Think that's who it was. Yeah, we have a ton of stuff. Uh, our otter exhibit is nearing completion. That should be done within about a month. Um, the contractors are close to being done, so we've got to do some work ourselves and add some substrate and so forth. And then we give them a couple of weeks' time to get themselves acclimated before we right. have guests around. Is it still going to be one of those setups where you can watch the otters like you've been able to and do? It's triple the size of what it used oh, to be. We used to have everybody one loves panel. the otters. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's, it, uh, 1988 was when it was built. So really, it's everybody's around always crowded around that little <laughs> yep. glass waiting for them to swim in. So a that's good bigger. news. So that's good. Uh, as, so associated with that, we have a new red panda exhibit that will be coming on because we had to knock the old one down because of, um, of the construction on this one. We have a new viewing panel, panel for our African wild dogs mm. is underway soon. And um, we're this later this summer, uh, we're getting uh, um, a refurbished train. So we sent one of our trains out to a place down in the south, and it's being converted to an electric train. Really? Yeah. So, so you we're won't have excited. the conductor? No, we'll still have a conductor. Okay, oh, thank no, goodness. No, 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 we, ju we just won't have the noise. We actually have to, we have to pipe noise into it. Yeah. Because it doesn't sound like a train. It okay. Does, so it, it, we're pretty excited about that. Yeah. It's green and it, it'll be a much smoother ride. We're, that'll be I didn't fun. know that you had more than one train. We have two, yeah. We have uh, um, 42, so it was the 42nd engine made by okay. that company and 344 is the other one. So we've had them for 1965. I was going to say, how old are they? Yeah. They both are the same age? No, the, the 42 is from 1965. The other one one's maybe 20 years older. Okay. Yep. But younger. a new one coming. Yep. yep. That's exciting. Yep. The kids love the train. They sure do. They it's love a highlight. all that kind of equipment. <laughs> That's true. Well, let's talk about equipment day. So Saturday, you'll have everything there for the kids to climb on and explore and enjoy. All kinds of stuff. And it's just amazing to me. Um, I remember when, when my boys were young, we marked it on the calendar like three months in advance. Mm -hmm. So we knew when equipment day was. And th there's tractors and there's um, uh, cement trucks and it uh, looks like there might be a mi military vehicle there. Um, sometimes we have ambulances. Um, we'll have uh, surprisingly even dumpsters. Yeah. We'll have uh, we'll have stuff from Pro Waste, and they'll bring um, a dumpster, and kids will get their picture taken in a dumpster. It's it's actually pretty cool. There's Where lots. Where do you put them all? All over the grounds. There's a lot on the front on the front lawn, but we put them throughout the grounds. In some cases, we have to have separate special steps so the kids can get up in it and they can steer it. Uh, some of them we actually unhook the battery because otherwise they keep buzzing the yeah. uh, ringing, ringing yeah. the, the uh, uh, How do you the, uh, get them into the zoo though? The back entrance? No, we get them all, there's been times where we've actually physically taken a section of the fence out okay. to bring them in. Some, yeah. of, some of them stay outside the gate. But one of our guys, John Ray, has been doing it forever mm -hmm. and it's his baby. And so he actually goes and picks some of this stuff up yeah. in different places. But it, it, it is without a doubt one of the most popular days at the zoo. And the first 1,500 kids get little construction helmets as well. So it's I love seeing all the pictures of my friends that have the little ones. There's just something about getting on those yep. great big pieces of, of machinery that the kids love. They sure do. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and it's a, it's a great photo moment. So again, that is this Saturday, uh, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. all day Saturday at the zoo. 10 to 2. 10, 10 to 2. two. The yes. Zoo's open from 10 go. to 6. Okay, but from 10 to 2, so you got to get there early. Yep. Um, and the rates are the same. Same as always. Yep. Even though remember it's, it's free, otherwise it's a regular normal zoo admission. Perfect. Erizoo.org. You bet. Scott, thank you. Right, thank you. Happy Memorial Day. Thanks to you Thanks too. Thanks for coming in today. Mm -hmm.